a very good morning to you dear students hope everyone is doing good in my last video there were few comments related with law of motion question number 4 dear students question number 4 i have solved it very clearly in one of my video i will unlist that video you can go through that video again and you will understand all the numericals again as i have said here dear students do practice all the numericals of all the chapters they are simple just you need is your full concentration as well as the formulas to use into the uh, into the numericals and solve it out still if you have any difficulty related with any kind of questions you can do comment and i will try to solve it out in my next video today dear students i am going to show you a sample question paper what does it mean sample question paper is let us go through our previous years question paper this sample question paper will help in finding out what kind of questions can come in exam like in my previous video i have given you portion as well as the pattern of writing the paper like what kind of questions or what pattern does the uh, the does the question paper follows like before you you all were having all fill in the blanks for five marks and all but now the pattern has little changed in which you get five marks all mixed questions let's go through the question paper so that you can understand more better so today we are going to see 2018 first semester question paper let's go through question number 1 your duration for your uh, writing your science one paper is 2 hours your marks are 40 okay so let's go through the question paper this is a sample question paper so by help of this question paper you can get an idea what kind of question paper can come in exam do practice this question paper it will help you all to understand more better how much you have studied and how much do you need to study more our first question is question number 1 a which is for 5 marks now here see there the first question stands here is the ph of sugar solution is dash right now i am not dictating the answers i will be dictating the answers of this question paper in my next video that time you can check your answers do solve this question paper in your in your notebook and do practice this properly it will definitely help you all to understand better how what kind of questions comes and how to present your answers the next is write the correlation positively charged ions is cation and negatively charged ions are dash match the following pair now you can understand in question number 1 only there are different types of questions not only fill in the blanks but in one question itself they have asked you fill in the blanks they have asked you correlation so if you follow that pattern what i have given y'all in your uh, where i have given syllabus as well as pattern there you will understand properly what type of questions do you need to do and many a time i have seen children they lose their marks only in objective question question answers they write it properly because those are direct questions but objective type of questions mainly come from textbook within the textbook so that's why you all lose marks there so do practice all the questions this type of questions where i hope everyone get out of marks now here match the pairs is given a group and b group where a is given electric current and potential difference where answers here are voltmeter and ampmeter you have to write down the answers so now let us move towards our next question our next question is write true or false write the original statement now make very very sure that dear students write the original statement here means what you have to make it if it is false you have to make it true and write and if it is true statement the same same statement you have to write if you do not write statement your half mark will be cut so make very sure that you do write the statement so the sta uh, the question here is in the industrial sectors the unit used to measure the power is called horsepower next question is find the odd man out distance speed time displacement 
क्वेश्चन नंबर बी क्वेश्चन नंबर बी फॉर फर्स्ट इज सिलेक्ट प्रॉपर अल्टरनेटिव फ्रॉम दोज गिवन बिलो एंड री राइट द स्टेटमेंट नाउ यर यू हैव टू जस्ट सिलेक्ट दी आंसर राइट इन फुल स्टेटमेंट एंड देन राइट इट डाउन सो यर इट इज फॉर फाइव मार्क्स न्यूटन्स डैश लॉ ऑफ मोशन इज यूज इन रॉकेट सेकेंड क्वेश्चन द इलेक्ट्रिक करंट डैश वेन द रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ द कंडक्टर इज इंक्रीज लेट्स मूव टू क्वेश्चन नेक्स्ट थर्ड क्वेश्चन द कलर ऑफ यूनिवर्सल इंडिकेटर पेपर इज डैश फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग डैश इज अ स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड न अबाउट स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड्स एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग बेसिस वीक एसिड्स एंड वीक बेसिस ऑल द एग्जाम्पल्स आई हैव गिवन यूर एज वेल एज इन द टेक्सट बुक ऑल्सो इट इज गिवन वेरी क्लियरली सो इफ यू गो थ्रू द टेक्सट बुक प्रॉपरली यू विल अंडरस्टैंड नेक्स्ट इज If four drops of phenolphthalein is added to an hydrochloric acid, the color of solution becomes dash. Now, question number two. Here is solve any five sub question from the following, and it's for ten marks. And so each question is for two marks. Now, two marks means how many points you have to write it down? At least there should be three points, which is out of that two points are selected, giving one one mark. Okay. So. write the law of conservation of energy first question next is distinguish between uniform motion and non uniform motion question number 3 if the charge is 400 c coulomb uh, flows through a conducting wire in a 5 minutes what is the value of the current next question is find out the molecular mass of the sodium hydroxide naoh where sodium uh, atomic masses is na24 O is sixteen and H is one. Now already this type of questions I have solved on the board and they are very simple, so easily you can score marks here. Write the chemical equation for the following reaction: zinc powder is added to a solution of concentrated H two SO four. What is meant by electric circuit? Next, write scientific reason: butter milk spoils if it is kept in copper container. Now. a very important instruction when you are writing extra questions like if it is said any five and in case you are writing all the sevens please do write extra on the extra question okay so it becomes easy for the teacher for correction and it becomes easy for you all to count the marks when you all are going through your paper okay so do write extra as an uh, uh, question if you are writing the extra questions answer Let's move towards next part now. Now the next question is question number three, which is answer, solve any five sub questions from the following. Our first question is draw the diagram of resistance in parallel and name it and write the formula to find out their effective resistance in circuit. Write write the type of salts and give one one example of each salt. what is meant by neutralization and give the example of every day life neutralization reactions question number 4 write a short note on domestic electric conductors or connections number 5 is an iron ball of a mass 10 kg is fired from a, ca a canode mass of 500 kg the canode uh, recoil with the velocity 5 meters per second find out the velocity of the iron ball question number 6 is what are the different uh, what are the different forms of energy illustrate how energy can be transferred from one type to another with the example next question number 7 is write ohm's law and draw the diagram of the experimental proof of the ohm's law question number 4 here is solve any one exam uh, sub question from the following so you just have to solve only one question and it's for 5 marks so our first question is write answers is write the symbol of aluminum the molecular mass of carbon so each questions consist of one mark if you write one question wrong your one mark goes there so five question each question one one mark so all together the whole question is for five marks The next is write the electronic configuration of boron. How can be how can be the size of atoms determined? Write the molecular formula of water. Next question, option question for this is 
read the following passage and answer the following question you just have to read the passage and just answer the following question so here the circuit is also given our first question is define electric circuit next which appliances measures electric current what is the function of the uh, voltmeter how amp meter and voltmeter are connected name the two types of electric charges in electric circuit so in this way i have given you one sample question paper to solve in your notebooks is this question paper is of 2018 now so this type of question paper can come in exam for your so do practice all this type of questions like write short note fill in the blanks or give reasons okay numericals diagrams all this type of questions can come in exam and we you do practice all this and do read the textbook properly because see in this paper also there are so many questions which are behind the textbook questions or within the textbook question so go through it properly go through all the objectives properly and i really uh, pray to god that let my all children get out of marks thank you be happy thank you